History of Eddie Van Halen's most famous guitars in 60 seconds. Go. Eddie Van Halen's first guitar was a Tessico Del Rey. Eventually, this guitar was retired in the mid 70s. Eddie said he wanted a Fender vibrato and a Stratocaster body with a humbucker in it, and that didn't exist. After repurposing a Gibson PAF pickup, Eddie built the white and black Frankenstrat that we know today. Although the Frankenstrat is probably Van Halen's best known guitar, he probably played the Shark more on early recordings. The Shark was a mid 70s Ibanez destroyer with Van Halen's trademark red, black, and white style. The yellow and black striped Bumblebee then showed up on the sleeve of Van Halen too. In the late 70s, Eddie revisited the famous Frankenstrat, painting it red, black, and white and adding a Floyd Rose double locking trim. In a chance meeting with Kramer's Dennis Bernardi, Eddie signed with Kramer Guitars. This produced Eddie's 50 150. Eddie then turned to Ernie Ball to make his Music Man EVH. Around the late 90s, Van Halen's relationship with Ernie Ball dissolved. This led to the relationship with PV and the EVH Wolfgang. In 2006, Eddie partnered with Fender to make the Frankenstrat 2. 